Hey guys, it's Lynn here. i um, doing my own recording here for the first time on uh, uh, 2 Fly Productions. And the game I'm doing is F-Zero X, as you saw from the beginning. And now keep in mind, I don't have the best computer, so I will experience uh, slight frame rate drops, and you'll notice that um, when choosing a, um, a ship jive, but that's pretty much the only time it lags. Everything else is fine. And I apologize for the quality, but that's the only way to get a solid 60 frames per second all the time because fraps it drops the frame rate to 30 no matter what um, if the frame rate just below 55 which it does a little bit but it it doesn't recover from that on its own so so I'm gonna go ahead and start it on novice here all right and then uh, after jack cub you'd see that's track and uh, let's see that's the lag I'm talking about I'm gonna do a quick ship choose and then it stops so basically this game is a racing game, which you'll see for the N64, and here we go. Yeah. That's basically the only live there is. The racing is just fine. But yeah, the racing, or the music in this game, is kick-ass. Um, so I'm going to stop talking now, so you guys can enjoy it, I guess, with the quality. So yeah, enjoy. Those arrows obviously are boosters and greatly accelerate you. And uh, the first lap, you don't have booster power, but the second and third laps, you do. And the booster power just takes away your health. Watch as the bar goes from red to green. Uh, boost power, okay. So it basically does the same thing as those, but drains your, uh, I guess, your energy. And but you can, or but you can use it whenever you want. So. Uh, my goal for this let's play is to come in first in every single race and I'll be doing that by abusing the booster and eventually upgrading my ship. When you don't upgrade your ship you just choose from better ones. So. And I'm playing with the keyboard right now because the only buttons you play or press are A and B. A to go, B to boost and the keyboard to move obviously. So uh, I'm doing okay but of course, there's a guy right on my tail. So I'm just going to use the boost power here, get him off my back. And there we go. That's the uh, first first little uh, match. Uh, not bad, 1 minute and 31 seconds. And this just shows you what place everyone came in. There's 30 NPC racers and oh gosh, big frame rate drop. Uh, yeah, sorry about that. Nothing I can do. Um, except, like, decrease the quality. I don't know if you guys want me to do that. Decrease the quality by a little bit to avoid those little lag spikes, but post in the comments whether or not you want me to. So here's the second track of the Jack Up. And, uh, personally, this is my favorite. I love the music on this one. This game is totally fun just because of how fast paced it is. Need to catch up. This uh, track is actually really hard to come in first because of all the boosters and the emphases are typically really good. And your rival is the person who came in the in either second or, or first place last time, depending on what uh, where you placed. As you can see, it's kind of realistic with the drag and stuff, depending on how, how fast you're actually going. But now is where I just abuse the boost to get up in turf. And uh, this pink stuff, it re um, kills you. And I just overlap that guy. Pretty cool. And uh, this commentary is live. I thought about doing a commentary over, but that's not as exciting to watch. So.
Ah, uh, lag again. Oh, I'll just... That is so annoying. And it's Fraps' fault, it's not my fault. I do have the computer for it, it's just Fraps. It really likes to uh, limit the frame rate to 30 no matter what I do, so. If you have any suggestions for that, let me know. And now uh, that little screen that I was just at, the, you can control whether or not you want to accelerate faster or or increase your max speed and this map is really fun um, the accelerating faster obviously you start off going really fast but your max speed is only like 700 kilometers per second or an hour sorry 700 kilometers per second would be extremely fast 3600 times faster than what I'm going well no then actually exactly. I don't know, just ignore that. At uh, max speed, you start off going really slow. And what I set it at uh, is a good acceleration rate and a decent max speed. So, tip if you ever decide to play this game. This game used to be my childhood, so. That's primarily why I'm playing it. Really. And that Captain Falcon. Uh, I'm gonna lose if I don't hurry up. I need to come in first. You don't have to come in first, or like, uh, I believe you just have to come in the come in the first six, as you can see on the left, in order to win like a trophy or whatever it is. But that's gonna be a problem. And there's the lag in. Oh, didn't last as long though in Devil's Forest. I'm gonna go ahead and do this one last race and uh, see where things go from there. Hopefully I'm not going too long. And that sluggish stuff right there, that slows you down drastically as you can see. So the ships in this game have three different classes and they use grades A through D I believe, and if not then it's A through E. But there's a handle which I believe controls how well your ship turns and such. Uh, excel, um, I think speed and then something else I can't remember. That stuff is going to kill me every time. I guess there's a little thing I can use to uh, get myself up there, which is to boost in the sluggish stuff. I'll be fine. And uh, when your energy runs out, uh, your ship blows up and you're basically just dead. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and take my chances with them, this one and go ahead and do the last track. I know I said map earlier, that was an accident, but the last track. Uh, for this cup, I believe, I'm not 100% sure. It's been a long time. So hopefully you're enjoying this so far, I know I am. Uh, this is Big Blue, the very famous track behind it. If you've never heard this song, then uh, you're missing out. I don't know where you are your, your entire life. If you're not careful, you can actually fly off of this track. And while that may not mean death 100% time, it's still really risky. Uh, a lot of tassers actually use that to their advantage. So if you have any uh, questions on this game or something like that, go ahead and leave a comment. I'll try my best to answer it. I'm no expert at this game, I just love playing it. Um, so yeah. Oh, 
Oh, so close. Ooh, he's gonna pass me. No. Oh, I thought that was I thought I was on the final lap. Yeah, oh well. Nah, I missed that. I'm dead. I'm gonna die, I know it. Unless I'm super careful. Oh, wow, I lived. I forgot that this stuff was right after it. I have to win. Yes! Alright. 143, not bad. And frame rate drop. I really don't know why it does it. Oh, and I guess that wasn't the last map. Well, okay then, uh, I guess for timing reasons, because I don't know how long this video is, I'm going to go ahead and stop it. So I hope you enjoyed episode one of me playing F-Zero X. This is without batteries, uh, so just me. So thank you for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time.